Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to solve question number second. In question number second, you have to classify these expression as monomial, binomial, or trinomial. And you also have to find if any of these expression do not fit in these categories. We know that what is a monomial, what is a binomial, and what is a trinomial. monomial is a whole is a expression having only one term binomial is a expression having two terms and trinomial is a expression having three terms or we know that if you want to find how many terms our expression has first of all we have to find the number of signs in that particular expression if we are able to find the number of signs so easily we are we would be able to find the number of terms in that particular expression so let's find the number of monomials in this in these expressions monomials means having only one term in this case one and two there would be two signs so this should be come in the category of binomial because we know that binomial is an expression having two terms here if nothing is written it can be considered as positive second one only one term so this should be monomial so this is cancel out this is cancel out this is 1 2 3 4 here there are four signs so this expression having four terms but we have to find only three term so this should come in the category which are not fit in monomial binomial and trinomial category so this should be other and this should come in the other category so it should be x square plus x cube x plus x square plus x cube plus x raised to power 4 this term having one two three terms so this term in the category trinomial in this again we have only two signs one of positive and one of negative here it is considered as positive so this should be binomial in this term again 1 2 3 there are three signs or you can say three terms so again it should come in trinomial category this is 2y minus 3y square plus 4y cube this is 1 2 3 again three terms again it should come in the category trinomial this is 5x minus 4y plus 3x y again this is having two terms so this come in the category binomial this is 4z minus 15 z square this term having 1 2 3 4 so this come this should come in the other category and this is only having one term so this should be monomial and in this we are having two terms so this should be binomial e square q plus p q square and the last one again having two signs or two terms so this should also come in the category binomial which is 2p plus 2q so simply if you want to find the monomial binomial or trinomial we have to we have to find the number of terms certain expression has and that is how you can find which category they are belongs thank you